In this video, I will show you how to easily adjust an iOS application to include UIKit for Mac and run on macOS Catalina. Let's start by opening an existing iOS project. In this case, I'm using the simple weather app we created in our previous video. It's a table view that shows temperature data downloaded from the internet. Turning this into a Mac app is easy. If you check the settings page for the project, you'll see there's a new setting called UI Kit for Mac. Simply change this option to yes, and that does the trick. When we look at the device picker at the top, Mac is now a valid option. We can run this app right away by clicking the Run button or pressing Command R. Nice! But let's tweak a few more things. First, Let's add a proper Mac application icon to the app. Right click the Resources folder and select New File from the pop up menu. Select Application icon from the list of templates. Click OK, then click Create File. Now the app will have a nicer looking icon in the dock and in the Finder. Let's also add a separate entitlements file so we can control runtime entitlements for macOS and iOS separately. Right click on Resources again and this time select Entitlements File, then click OK, then Create File. Let's have our app run sandboxed and specify it will need to access the network. Go back to the Settings pane, and we can set both the new icon file and the Entitlements file to be used for the Mac version by updating these settings. Press Command-R to run again, and our app comes up with the new icon and properly sandboxed. Of course, what we have so far is an iOS app running on the Mac, not a real Mac app. Depending on the app, additional work is needed to make your app feel truly at home. For example, adding a custom menu resource, setting up keyboard shortcuts, touch bar support, but we'll leave those for another time. Mm -hmm. 